A marketing class at Brainerd High School recently partnered with a local bar and grill to create, design, and market two new burgers for their menu. The challenge pitted the two burgers against each other at the 612 station in downtown Brainerd to see which one was ordered the most. With this week's Golden Apple, reporter Rachel Johnson has the story. The Cowboy Burger and the Old Mobile. These are the names of two unique burgers created by the Brainerd High School marketing class for their new burger challenge. Basically the students had to come up with different burger ideas and um, then working with the 612 station here in town, they were kind of voted on top two ideas and um, from there they broke into teams and developed all the marketing material. Landon Brainerd approached fellow teacher Ellen Fussy, who owns the 612 station to see if they would want to partner for the project. I said sure and so they developed a burger challenge and the kids all developed a hamburger and I think 13 hamburgers and they voted on the top two. The students learned every step that goes into creating a new business item. They uh, put up posters around the school, they developed a radio ad, they did a commercial ad, they put on Facebook and um, they just did a real good job creating excitement around their product and that's what marketing is. The two burgers are put on the menu for two weeks with the winning burger getting to stay. We did a two week competition so then over those two weeks however many people went in and um, ordered the burgers and that ended up being the winner. The winning burger, the cowboy burger, has bacon, cheddar cheese, a house Reno sauce, and mac and cheese bites. The project was mutually beneficial for the students and also for the business that they partnered with. The customers have been excited. They've asked a lot of questions. Um, we have um, sold a lot of hamburgers and I just think um, we saw probably a higher traffic than normal over the two week period of the Burger Challenge. The Burger Challenge was not only fun for the students, but it gave them the chance to gain real world experience in marketing. It was pretty interesting. Actually, it's a lot different than just like doing simulations and like links on his website. I think any chance that we get to get some, some you know, real world experience um, and apply the information that we're learning in class. Otherwise, it's, it's sort of isolated and they don't really see the, maybe the true value. Mr. Brainerd and the marketing class hope to keep the project going and partner with more local businesses in the future. Future. Reporting from Brainerd with this week's Golden Apple, Rachel Johnson, Lakeland News. And the winning burger is still currently being offered at the 612 station. Never had cool projects like that when I was in high school. <laughs> no, and then it looked good. I'm, I'm yeah. hungry already thinking about it. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.